the time that you play here, cameras change a little bit. Any one thing stand out, the new camera? Uh, that's a tough question. Uh, the thing I like best is the new facility over there. You know, the, pra the practice area and the weight room over there is just spectacular. But the uh, camera looks really good. It's been around for a long time. It's got a long history. And um, the thing that makes it what it is uh, is the fans. First countdown to craziness. What are your thoughts? It's crazy, man. It was, it was a, probably the best atmosphere I've seen since I've been here. Talk about your uh, performance in the video, in particular with the lemurs. How did that go for you? You know, I thought I did a decent job. It wasn't really the highlight of the video, but I thought it brought the video together, and I thought that was very, uh, a very sweet piece. You've won a lot of awards. You were day National Player of the Year, All-American, NBA All-Star. Craziest choice. Where did it rank up? I got to say that, you know, after my wife and my children, I would say that's the best thing that's ever happened to me, the Cameron, Cameron Craziness Award for the uh, best last second shot. There's the pass to Leitner. Puts it up. Yes! Dowsing, what, what would the 99-2000 Jason Williams be introduced to? I, okay, how about this? The 2009 would have came out to the same song Nolan had. I like it. It was, you know, hey, I'm here. I'm on, a, I'm on the scene. I thought it was a good idea to pick songs because it, it brought more excitement for each individual guy knowing they can come out to their favorite song. And to me, what, what made me choose my song, I'm a, I'm a big on old school hip hop. And when my song came on, it got me hype. I almost slammed the Blue Devil. So I have fun out there. <laughs> Dre, yo, dunk contest jam, coaching. Not to, to. And how about the OC? The, the OC zoom zoom with the uh, motorcycle throttle thrust or whatever you want to call it. You know, he brought his A game. It's a motorcycle. Uh, you know, every time in uh, high school or AU when I dunked, uh, I'd be doing this thing, throwing up this thing after after every dunk. So uh, we call it motorcycle down in the West Coast. So. What was your reaction to the dunk contest? First ever. Um, you know, first off, my first reaction, extremely jealous that I didn't have a chance to participate in a dunk contest. But no, uh, it, it, it was exquisite. It was great. You know, to see Andre get out there and his first time being in front of Cam and Crazies and him have fun and kind of let loose and enjoy the experience. And you know, Mason always brings a different kind of excitement to the game. And, you know, then you have Nolan. You know, Nolan is the most outrageous guy I know and I met. And he has such a great sense of humor and personality. For him to do the Johnny Dawkins throwback jersey and embrace it and not be shy about it uh, says a lot about his kid and his kind of swagger. And that kid's going to have a special year. I, I think it was an amazing night. The atmosphere was unbelievable. And they can imitate that atmosphere every home game. Duke is going to be hard to beat. If a current player could go retro and break out the Christian Leighton jersey, which player would it be? Probably Shire. I like Shire's game a lot. The, uh, that was great when Nolan did that tonight, and you know, I don't think any, I don't think a lot of people knew how good of a point guard he was, and, and they, they changed him over to the point guard position last year a little bit. He did a great job. Uh, they might have like a two guard attack this year, but I'm impressed with him. And I told his parents that when he was a freshman. I said he, he's young. He's got to get some strength, but he's a good player. He's very headsy, can really shoot, score, and he's a very good point guard also. Uh, I, I think it's a great opportunity, you know, come back and hang out with the guys and, you know, hear their stories and, and see their passion. Uh, a great story in particular was Mason Plumley. You know, be, an hour and a half before the game, he wanted to come out and warm up. And, you know, I'm like, oh, relax, relax, relax. He's like, what did you do before the game to warm up? And I was like, I just went and I rode the bike. So I came back in the locker room and I saw him riding the bike and just getting all that extra energy out uh, before the game. So when you get a chance to, to tell a younger guy you know, some of the things you did before the game to kind of relax yourself and let loose, and then you see him follow what you say, it's a huge thing. Uh, these guys, they learn, they listen, and uh, that's why they're the best of the best. Well, it's wonderful. It brings back so many memories. I love when... Uh, when I'm invited back here and uh, WK gave me a call and of course I wanted to come and it's just the best atmosphere to play college basketball. Here being something that's going to build a great tradition for around this time in the future.